I mean, we're getting a ton of XP here. I definitely want to try and make my way over to the, um... To the, uh... One where it boosts our, um... Whatchamacallit? Our XP gain. And grab you. I wonder if that paralyzed works on, uh, works on a boss. We are taking a lot Yo, 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 everybody, what's going on? It's Lotus here, back with another Nordic Ashes run. We're going to run it back and see what we can get happening today. We're going to run Helga once again. Um, since we don't really... We could run him. Um, we already did pretty dang good on her. Um, I did say that I was thinking about running Poison Bomb again, but I don't know if I necessarily want to try that or even... Um, run swords or stormbringer on uh, medium here but i think i want to try and run helga and try one of these um either ace or air um i'm not sure uh you know what let's try ace since we already have that one leveled up actually let's go air just so we can unlock the uh the whatchamacallit the next upgrade and we're gonna do hard so hopefully we can catch a W here. We'll see how we'll see how this goes. Should be pretty interesting. <clears throat> so this one summons owls that orbit around you. Each summon will fly a little bit farther than the previous one. Okay. So you can kind of gauge um, this by walking closer or farther from from the uh, from the monsters. So shouldn't be too hard. Should be actually pretty easy. Um, I wonder if we can get, like, a lot more of these, and, like, if we can destroy stuff quicker and better, easier, faster. <laughs> uh, but we'll see. Alright. Yeah, if you all have been enjoying the content, make sure you guys tap that like button down below, I'd greatly appreciate it. Also, if you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe, every little bit counts, and I do greatly appreciate it. I totally did not see that. Um, and come join the the club to be uh, one of the first uh, ones before a thousand subs and uh, join the club. Um, let's see. Area projectile speed. I mean, if we could juice up the speed, that'd be huge. Damage and projectile speed, sure. Now we can reroll and try and get summons. Yep. Yep. Ooh, I like that one too, baby. Okay. So we got three. Projectile speed would actually be pretty massive if we can, like, juice that up a lot. Um, because monsters are totally going to be an issue here. Um, because we are playing on hard, they're going to get juiced up pretty quick. Um, so I'm going to go projectile speed. The more speed, the better. If we can just get them zooming around us, that'd be insane. Alright. Not bad. Getting a ton of ton of XP here, which is pretty good. I want, like, two or three more, I think, projectile, or, uh, yeah, projectiles, summons. Um, but I would also love to get, like, a bunch more speed, too. So we got 14 points. Summons and projectile speed is, like, perfect. Area and summons, yep. Damage and area, I think I'm gonna reroll this one. Summons and area, uh, I don't want that area. I'll take that one. Projectile speed and area, sure. Ooh, we're gonna reroll that one for sure. Damage and summons, I'll definitely take. That's a huge damage boost. That's double damage. That's actually crazy. Okay, we got a ton of uh, projectiles now. What is that, six? Okay, that's pretty gnarly. That is pretty gnarly. Activate the effect probability, I, I, uh, effect probability obelisk three times. Okay, cool. So we did that. That's pretty sweet. Um, let's make our way towards, um, one of the other ones now. That damage one is gonna be an insane boost, though, that's for sure. Um, I can see, I can see these owl, this owl run being pretty, pretty crazy. So I'm not really too, too worried about that. Other than, like, maybe losing sight of, like, some of these monsters that we could run into. Um, because they blend in with the ground so, so well. Um, but let's make our way towards, uh, some of these other obelisks before we, um... Before it's too late. So we'll get this. Um, 
gold is like never an issue. Like we get so much gold, it's insane. All right, let's make our way up here towards this rock. This one I think is new. I don't remember seeing this one before. Oh, this is just one that gives it to us. Okay, I'll take the red heart because that boosts some um, our stuff here. So, what is this one? Owls gain a 200% movement speed for 5.25 seconds with a cooldown. Okay, sure, I'll take that. Um, projectile speed, I mean, of course. And then I think I'm going to go for adds two red heart containers because I think I'm going to go for experience again. Um, duration. I mean, we don't really have anything that deals with duration. So, yeah, we're not going to do that. All right, let's make our way down toward the bottom now. I do want to try and get five points because that um, double damage buff is going to be actually pretty flipping crazy. So <clears throat> I definitely want to try and do that. 15 seconds shouldn't be a problem here. Adds one full red heart container. That's actually pretty wild. So I'll definitely take that for sure. Um, is this a build? Uh, this might be a build where you could almost kind of stay still, but not quite. We're going to need to juice up the damage quite a bit. I mean, we could go stars again. Um, I did I did enjoy that. Um, but I think I want to try and go the, um, the deck of cards, right? No, I want to go, yeah, I, I want to go cards, because if we can get cards, then we can throw a, um, and ascend into that, and then we can go from there, because that means, if we can throw in an ascend into that, that means everything will be, we'll be able to get double ascends on, so that's, that's sort of going to be our goal, if we can do that. So, let's get this show on the road, doing a little bit of damage. Paying too close attention to this, yeah. Okay. I mean, it's blue hearts, not the end of the world. Um, but still, don't want to take too much damage. We are playing on hard mode after all. Okay, so we got that, which was more damage. What is this one? Has two empty red heart containers. Sure, I'll take that. Because so I believe we have some healing down here. Um, we do have all the obelisks and stuff as well that we could take, so keep an eye on that. Um, definitely smoking that up. Picking up some of that gold. Got 30 pieces, not a lot. I mean, we could easily juice it up some more. Um, oh, we got this now, so let's come here. Let's take that. Let's um, take the two full red heart containers, and then I'm going to dump some more. Get a total of 10 hearts or more heart containers in a run. Okay with Helga. Alright. Holy smokes. Look at the speed on these guys. Alright. I mean, we're getting a ton of XP here. I definitely want to try and make my way over to the, um... To the, uh... One where it boosts our, um... Whatchamacallit? Our XP gain. Grab you. I wonder if that paralyzed works on uh, works on a boss. We are taking a lot more damage than I would like, so we gotta be careful here. Okay, our projectiles are spinning like flipping crazy. Holy shnikes, dude! It's actually flipping crazy. Okay. Honestly, did not see that wolf uh, encroach on us. Okay, and we got the boss now too. Part of me is not really too, too worried, other than, like, if we take damage. I mean, we are shredding this boss. Holy smokes, dude. And, like, you can almost kind of gauge this, too. Ooh, sneaky bugger, man. Okay, well, we just smoked that. We're gonna get a ton of points. We're gonna pretty much probably be almost, uh, 25 points here. Ah, 25 points exactly, okay. In Noki's realm, we'll grab this. Let's see... Some gold there. Looks like we got a little bit of healing over here as well. <clears throat> Adds one red heart container. I'll take it. Shoots arrows. Sure, why not? Attracts all red potions on the ground. Oh, that's what that does. Grants a blue heart. It breaks one hit. Sure. And I guess I'll take you as well. Um, let's jump over here. We're going to upgrade the crap out of projectile speed as well. Um, we got you. Duration. I mean, 
We have to take it. I'll take you. I mean, we could juice up XP, but I also want to... Um, I mean, attack speed I don't think is going to matter since it's a projectile. Um, so I think I'm going to go with this since it's a 40%. Oh, I have to take one of these first. Um, area, maybe. And then I was gonna go into cards. R ascend. Cards grow over time. Okay. Um, and then let's juice up. I could juice up this too. Um, oh, I want the alt, I think, as well. But let's boost this up. Okay. Then we'll jump over here. Damage and cooldown. Sure. Cool. Let's do this. Oh, and with that one, it's projectiles. So, like, that's actually huge because, like, that's what we're kind of doing. So, cards are projectile. Holy crap, look at how big those cards are. Okay. So, cards could be a pretty crazy um, run as well. This is that 50% damage one um, until you get hit. Which could be pretty good. Um, but we have a bad habit of getting hit over here. <clears throat> so... I definitely would like some more healing to get all of our red hearts back. Or to get all red hearts, which could be useful. Um, if you guys didn't see the last run with Helga, make sure you guys go check it out after this, because um, that was pretty crazy. Uh, we ran um, the Constellation, the Stars. <clears throat> I think it was Book of Stars. Pretty, pretty gnarly. <clears throat> so definitely go check that out after this one. Alright, let's make our way back up through here. Grab all of this. Um, burn damage? I mean, sure, we don't really have any burn, but um, I believe it adds burn to the items. So, we'll do that. We shall do that. Let's see here. <clears throat> Gotta be careful of this guy, because this guy will sneak up on us with the, uh, with the zappers there. Okay, what do we got? Give us more projectile speed. I mean, I'll take another summon. Sure, why not? Sure, why the heck not? Okay. I mean, projectile speed feels pretty good. I mean, even when we're throwing the cards out, it doesn't seem that bad. I mean, damage could definitely get increased on that. That's for sure. Okay. Let's see here. Got a lot of XP down here to the south. There we go, we got that. And the east over here, or the west I should say. Got tons of XP down here. Try and collect all of this. I mean, we're we're gonna have another end of this wave, so we'll, we'll be able to collect it all when we defeat the boss. So I'm not too, too worried. Uh, let's make our way up to uh, this altar up here. Need that 50% extra damage, because why not? Okay. Now, now we just need to not get hit. Okay. It's tough because, like, um, a lot of the, the, the smaller little rats definitely blend in um, to the ground on this one, so. But I think we're looking pretty good. Um, the next few that we're going to get, we're probably going to dump into cards. Maybe uh, XP attraction if we get enough to do that. Um, because boosting that up, of course, wouldn't be wouldn't be a bad idea. Also, juicing up um, uh, the Book of Stars probably wouldn't be bad either, since we will get another... Um, I mean, we already have it, so like we could just throw it into uh, the... Um, we could just ascend the Book of Stars, since we already have one point in it. And we could try out the uh, second... Um, the second... Uh, up there goes. There goes the... Uh, our relic there, the Glass Sword. Walked right into that red raven. Oh well. We could get the second other, uh, basically the one that we unlocked in the last episode. Um, let's see what that uh, book of relics does. Alright. So it does look like we're full HP, which is pretty huge. Should be able to get a good amount of XP here. I mean, we are pretty juiced on XP. Damage is decent on the birds. Nothing too crazy. Definitely wouldn't mind more, um, more meta progression. I mean, don't get me wrong. We're sitting at 60 already, which is pretty good. 
but I definitely would not mind more. Ooh, lots of XP right down here. The owls are definitely not bad. They feel pretty good. Lots of XP around, that's for sure. Definitely more than we can, uh, more than we can pick up. That's for a fact, but hey, we're looking we're looking pretty good. Owls are actually freaking crazy. Holy smokes, dude. I think cards will be pretty good too. The tarot cards one, the deck of cards, that one might be a little little more iffy, but um I think we're doing pretty good here. Projectiles damage, duration. I think I'd rather take I think I'd rather take damage on the arrows, to be honest with you. Unless we start upgrading Book of Stars, then that's going to be a different story. Um, we got 16 points, so let's throw some points into something here. Let's max you out. Let's get our ultimate. Let's throw projectiles and critical, damage and cooldown, projectiles and critical, um, damage and projectiles. Uh, yeah, I'll just, I guess, throw all points into it. I mean, it doesn't really matter what we take. Um... Overall, I think it's going to still be pretty good, so we'll see here. We shall see here. Okay, now we are juicing our cards. Holy crap. We're throwing like three at a time. Five at a time, actually, it looks like, so we're actually looking pretty gnarly on this one, so I'm really not feeling... I think we're going to shred through this boss pretty quickly if we can get our owls right. We gotta be careful because we are in hard mode, so he's probably going to go Berserk. At some point, we're actually not doing as much damage as I thought we would be doing. Yeah, there we go, there we go, there we go. It's down to half. Get our Owls doing the damage. I mean, we are throwing uh, cards at him, <clears throat> so we're doing pretty good there. Owls are doing work. There they go again with the speed. Okay. And we should kill them right about here. Boom, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, sweet. That was easy. Easy enough, I'd say. Alright. Let's get this. What do we got here? Each enemy has a 50% chance of being poisoned. Sure. <coughs> Boom. We got... How many hearts we got? 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 hearts. Holy flip, dog. <clears throat> Swords spin around you? Sure. Throw spears in directions that pierce all enemies? Sure. Why not? We got the gold to do so, so let's do it, baby. Let's do it. Might as well take it. Alright, let's jump right on in and see what we got going on here. <clears throat> see if we can make something happen. Alright, I mean, we're, we're still looking pretty, pretty dang juiced. I'm really not worried about any of this. Even if we take some hits, I'm, I'm not really worried about it. <laughs> so, yeah, look at us just wipe that. I mean, we are doing 40 damage per owl. I'd, I'd rather hope to um, get um, more damage than that. Oh, well, would you look at this? Oh, but we take more damage, so we gotta be careful now. That one's always a... a, a, a <laughs> That's always one where I'm like, oh, 50% more damage, I'll take that. But then you get the extra um, 0.5 damage on the heart, and it's like, ooh, maybe I shouldn't have taken that, because now if we get hit, we're going to get smoked, dude. But, hey, it is what it is. We'll see. It's part of the game, so hopefully hopefully we can do okay. Um, I think this gives me a red heart, doesn't it? No, it doesn't. Well, this just shoots out fireballs everywhere, so. Easy peasy lemon squeezy baby. Give us that more meta progression. More the merrier. More the merrier. Okay. Holy cow, we just wiped the floor with that guy. Alright, let's get um, this going. Damage and cooldown. Projectiles and attack speed. I'll take. Ooh. Ooh, I'd rather get damage and project. Ah, that could be actually kind of crazy. That could be actually kind of crazy. And area could be insane too with the cards, making them super, super big. So I think I'm going to throw a couple points into this as well. As um, we could do attack speed as well. Um, and then I'm going to throw this guy on. And Constellations Link now deal 4 to 7 damage. 
Okay. Sure. We'll try that one out. Definitely would not mind getting, um... So the attack speed definitely helps with the cards. Holy cow, they are actually pretty big. Like, they get to a good size. Like, look at how big they get. Um, I also would not mind upgrading the... I mean, we're halfway through. We should be able to get pretty... Oh, was not paying attention there. We should be able to get pretty high in the, um... The levels? Like, we're at level 96 right now. Like, we should be able to get a few more levels to, um, really juice up our, uh, our stat points. So we should be able to, I would say we should be able to get, um, Constellation going. Or leveled up a good bit. Okay. I'm not really worried about getting gold because, like, this is the last round before we go to the boss, so, like, I'm not, I'm not really too worried about that. Okay. Should kill this wolf, I'd say, fairly quickly. I mean, if we have to, we could pop our ult. But I believe it's just a, a random buff. I don't think it's anything crazy. Alright, we got 11 points now. Because, the, yeah, her all, Helga's ultimate ability, this ancient recipe grants buffs that will stack each time she takes a sip. I mean, realistically, we should throw another one into this to decrease it and the duration increase, but... I really want to upgrade this. Damage and cooldown. Um, let's reroll that. Duration and projectile, sure. Damage, cooldown. I'd rather get damage and uh, projectiles. Okay, that works for now. Um, I'm not going to throw a point into attraction because we do have a little bit. We could get a couple more levels. Um, plus, throwing a point into a attraction is like just a just a waste of a stat point. I mean, well, then again, we are on the last one and there is a ton of XP around, so maybe, maybe it won't be a waste. Maybe it won't be a waste. Totally took a hit there. I gotta be careful because it's, it's one heart worth of damage. So. They're gonna hurt. And the boss is gonna hurt a lot too. I mean, we're facing Ragnar. Ragnar, so I'm not I'm not gonna be too too worried about it. He's he's a pretty easy boss to fight now that we know um, all of his dealios, so I'm not really too too worried about fighting him. Okay. Make our way this way. Ooh, what do we got here? Ooh, a chance to freeze, it looks like. I think I'm gonna try and save that for the boss. And here we go. So, let's throw... Points into you. Points into you. Duration and cooldown. Let's do one reroll. Area duration, that's a bit of a bummer, but I'll take it. It's level 8, so... <clears throat> we should be able to, hopefully, smoke it. Um... At a decent pace. I wish I had a ring there, but hey, that's it's okay. It's not the end of the world. Um, let's see how quickly we can uh, wipe him out. Probably not super quick, because our damage isn't crazy. Um, but, I mean... We're already down a quarter HP on him. So, we might... Oh, I was not paying attention there. Did one and a half parts. I mean, the good thing is, is that we're wiping out all the ads that's around us. Holy cow, this is lasting forever. We are wiping out all the ads, so, like, they're not really going to be a, a factor for us. So, we're doing good on that front. He's down to half HP, which is huge. Okay. Him throwing out those two, uh, like, slashes is big. Same with that one, because, like, they're super easy. I mean, all of his attacks are pretty easy to dodge. So I'm not really too worried on that, uh, front. Okay, we're shredding his damage, or his HP there, when they, uh, use their boost. Oh, I forgot I had this. Okay. Not the best to use that right, standing right next to me. He's about to die right about here. Bada bing, bada boom, baby. That was super easy. 
super easy. Helga is probably one of the better characters, I would say. I mean, they're all pretty good, but use the air flying spiral ascension. Freeze path. Ooh, use the cards magnified cards ascension. Okay, okay. So it looks like we unlocked two there, two new ascensions, which is pretty crazy. Air definitely doing some work. 495 DPS. I mean, cards did pretty good too. 165, I was not expecting that. So that's pretty good. Um, didn't unlock anything new, so nothing too crazy, but it's all right. I, I'd say that was a pretty good run. Um, jump back over here, dump 155 seeds in. Um, potions have a 30% uh, chance to heal an extra half a red heart. Overhealed hearts will turn into blue hearts. Oh, that could actually be pretty good. But I think I'm going to throw a lot of points into um, the uh, combat tree here. Um, let's see. Definitely attack speed. Attack damage, no. Cooldown, yup. I'll throw some in the cooldown duration area. Crit damage we could do. No, we can't because we need three. I mean, we could throw it into projectile speed. Um, could also throw it into crit. Rerolls, fire damage, rerolls, status duration, effect probability, poison. I think I'm going to throw it into critical. Yeah. And I think we're looking pretty good. I do want to try and max out attack speed at least and attack damage. That's like 14 right there. So definitely start making our way, like start maxing out some of the combat tree as well. Even though I feel like the healing tree could be pretty easy to max out, but okay. is what it is. Um, and you get the revives at the end there. But this is crazy. It adds an extra upgrade to relics every time you level them up. Um, reset probability when completed shrines have a 0% chance of resetting. Each reset reduces the probability of the next reset itself. You may now gather up to 250 gold. Oh, holy crap. I didn't know that you could do that. That you could break through to gather more gold. Not that the gold really helps us out in any way, other than like we get to buy stuff. Which I believe we could increase the amount of stuff we get in a shop, I think. Somewheres. Um, good versions of the minimap that shows seeds and artifacts. That actually would be huge to get. Um, maybe we already got it? We could max out the experience gain as well. And the amount of levels that we start with could be pretty big. But anyways, hopefully y'all enjoyed this. If so, make sure you guys tap that like button down below. If you guys are new to the, level, uh, new <laughs> to the channel, make sure you guys tap that uh, subscribe button. I'd greatly appreciate it. And uh, you guys can join the club before uh, before 1,000 and uh, help us get there. Um, once again, I do appreciate you guys. This has been Nordic Ashes, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.